saving the best to last, poor Talbot and Neath. Paul Talbot up next.
remember a good citizen is an obedient citizen. Namanya slave unit G to sector Alpha 7 for a retraining. Remember, conversations within the train terminal are restricted to the subject of immediate transport needs. Remember, the compliance norms can detect the pheromones of those who forgot to take their credit for the enlargements. This is where you belong. This is your home. You are happy. However, I do have some good news to report. The Art Deco Plaza Cinema is, is it, uh, it's been completely restored. It's wonderful. Oh. Right. That's all the good note you're getting because we're going to Neath next. Hold your breath. It's going to get brutal. Neath. Let's do this. I'll just ease you in gently with the old post office. Hmm, nice. We'll just overlook the train station. That's harmless. I don't believe it, they've actually tidied up this block of shops. Disappointing. It's actually beautiful. And ignoring the rather bland job centre, we move on to... Oh, what a combination. <laughs> and continuing down that street. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. There's more. Oh, 
there. Uh, whole street. Peace. Uh, uh. oh. And just when you think you've recovered from Argos, Poundland and uh, Pepco, this just smacks you in the face. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, oh. The infection has spread to the neighbouring building. Oh, oh, oh. It continues. I mean, to be fair, it does have some Art Deco intentions, which it blandly fails to achieve. Mm -mm. Oh, I hope that's the end of it. Huh, that looks quite tidy to be fair. Even the brutalist King Wilco has managed to turn out quite a tidy appearance in Neath. Oh, okay, that was Port Talbot and Neath brutalist tour. Others I've done, talking Cumbran, Penrhys, <sighs> Forgot, <laughs> Subscribe, and if you can think of any more brutal places in the UK that need a visit, comment below. <laughs>